Building and duct defects cause all kinds of problems in all types of houses, whether the house was built by a conscientious builder or one that just slapped together a structure. All are affected, and it doesn't matter if it is tract housing or a McMansion. Defects cause problems related to sustainability, how durable or long-lasting the building is, indoor environment, are the occupants safe from contaminants and hazardous materials, and energy efficiency, can the occupants heat and cool their house affordably? Diagnostic tools are used by auditors, performance contractors, and others to identify and quantify these problems. For houses, a blower door is used to pressurize or depressurize a house. The graphic shows what happens when a blower door is turned on. All the leaks in the structure can be easily found. Blower doors, as well as other diagnostic tools, are used to document the air tightness of buildings, estimate natural infiltration rates, measure and document the effectiveness of air sealing activities, and measure duct leakage in forced air systems. The tools used are the Minneapolis blower door and the Minneapolis duct blaster. The duct blaster, when combined with a theatrical fogger, can help to visualize all sorts of problems in ductwork. An infrared camera, when combined with a blower door, is very useful to find problems related to the structure or insulation and to help identify air pathways. It takes just a few minutes to assemble the frame and panel and place it in the door. The fan is then added. Hose connections from the outside and from the fan to the gauge, complete the assembly. Leakage values are displayed on the gauge as the house is pressurized to 50 pascals. To measure duct leakage, the auditor goes through a similar process of connecting the duct blaster to the HVAC system. Leakage is determined when we reach 25 pascals. In the beginning, we showed you some common problems. Here are the air sealing solutions most commonly used to fix duct leakage and house leakage problems. Duct leakage in the trunk is sealed by using duct mastic. Boot connections are sealed with mastic and caulk. Studies show that a single boot to register connection can be as much as 15 CFM of leakage. A house with 14 boot connections can leak over a half a ton of air. A hole in the floor above a crawl space that leads to the kitchen cabinets is plugged and sealed. This tub enclosure is actually a return plenum for the air conditioning system that is open to the house. In addition, there is a leak to the interior stud wall that leads to the attic. To learn more, visit energyconservatory.com.